I decided to start going to church. I've never been to church before. My wife, Brandy, always says, let's go to church. And I'm like, no, I always put it off. We met a few friends that were going through some things and they always talk about how God helped them in their lives. And I'm like, well, didn't really believe it because I didn't believe in God. So on Easter, I decided to say, well, let's give it a shot. My feelings coming back to church was natural. Like I've been here forever. Walking in, it was kind of overwhelming seeing everybody standing outside. Um, but we first walked up and Leah came up to us and approached us and wanted us, she was so, so eager to help us. Um, gave us our little goodie bag. And then we walked into church and we found our, our seat. And uh, this one guy just came up to me and just put his hand on my shoulder and said, good morning, I'm glad to see you. And that just changed. Like, it made me just fit in like this is where we should be. Um, my whole goal was just to come to here one time, go to another church and say we're done. I did the church thing. But between the events of that one guy, the friendliness of feeling like a family here uh, changed the way my life is and we decided to stay going to church here. We decided to start the starting point class because I felt like I knew that there was a lot I didn't know. I didn't know where to start. I'd never read the Bible. I don't even know if I owned a Bible at that time. And so I thought, well, what the heck? You know, we worked through these books and it was easy to talk about. Um, and it, it was comfortable, it was, it was a comfortable setting to answer those questions like, how do you pray? Um, what is God to you? How do you fit into the family? Um, and then this is the relationships that you build and form with people and the starting point is now just our new life group and we just build as friends and going through God's Word and just growing with Him. So on the first night of our starting point class, I had felt that I needed to ask God to come into my life and I asked Him and, and gave my life over to God. A few weeks after she did it, I decided to de devote my life to God and ask Him for forgiveness. and start the journey and walking with him. Life was kind of hard for us before we had made the decision to come back to church. We've been struggling with infertility for a little while now, and since going to church, I feel like it's brought me around people who have also struggled with infertility, and through that I've met people who have done the adoption process. I see that there's a plan for me and that I'm not in control. I, I don't get angry as easy because I know like I have no control over it. And, and struggling with infertility, I don't feel like it's a struggle as more of a learning and knowing that maybe it's not meant for me to have a baby physically because there's a baby out in the world that needs us. My life's been completely changed. I feel God has always been in my life, even though I didn't believe in Him. Um, looking back, I knew He was there and it just led me to church and becoming a believer. And, going through this whole adoption process and we're all adopted and you know by God so that's huge for me and before I would look at my situations as you know, why me and pity and now I just looked as he has a plan for me I just gotta follow it and just let it play out and trust him.